President Trump has reported plans to secure your entitlement to expend legitimate pot, vetoing an update issued by lawyer Jeff Sessions. As indicated by Republican Senator Cory Gardner, Trump by and by guaranteed him that he will back congressional endeavors to secure states' rights to lawful cannabis, successfully rendering Jeff Sessions' endeavors to prohibit the medication futile. NyDailyNews.com reports, the Sessions' reminder looked to invert Obama time strategies on recreational pot and alluded to a government crackdown. Late Wednesday. I got a dedication from the president that the Department of Justice's rescission of the coal reminder won't affect Colorado's legitimate weed industry, Gardner said in an announcement Friday. Besides, President Trump has guaranteed me that he will bolster a federalism-based authoritative answer for settle this present state's rights issue for the last time. Gardner, whose state authorized recreational pot in 2014, debilitated to obstruct all Justice Department chosen people after Sessions' January reminder. In light of Trump's telephone call, the representative said he has had a difference in heart. In view of these duties, I have educated the organization that I will lift my outstanding hangs on Department of Justice candidates, Gardner said. Sessions did not respond publicly to the improvement but rather a source acquainted with the issue told the Daily News that the Justice Department had not been counseled before Trump's telephone call. White House Squeeze Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders affirmed Gardner's announcement. We're continually counseling Congress about issues, including states' rights, of which the president is a firm devotee and the announcement that the representative put out before today is exact, Sanders told journalists at the White House Friday. Sessions has been a staunch rival of cannabis sanctioning all through his political vocation. The 71-year-old Alabama local was obstructed from a government judgeship on the grounds that an African-American partner affirmed that he once kidded that he thought the Ku Klux Klan was all right until he discovered they smoked pot.